Sydney looked at the world's best metro systems and said, let's do the expensive version. The Northwest Metro opened in 2019 after the budget jumped from 8.3 to 11.5 billion Australian dollars. The government promised automation, sleek stations, and full integration. They delivered two out of three. The driverless trains work perfectly when they're not breaking down, which happens often enough that commuters keep backup plan. The line serves Sydney's Northwest Corridor, an area developed just to justify the metro. That's backwards planning, building suburbs to fill trains instead of trains to serve people. Integration with the old rail network is a joke. Passengers transfer by walking through malls and across busy streets. The second harbor crossing and city loop remain unfunded after ballooning costs scared politicians. Now Sydney has an orphaned metro line, disconnected from where most people need to go. Weekend shutdowns for maintenance make the modern system less reliable than the buses it tried to replace.